everyone welcome back to my channel thank you for watching um go ahead and like and subscribe and my name is Tiffany Phillips I'm an independent Scentsy consultant and I over the next few days I'm going to be doing a series of sniffing out the testers with you guys as consultants we can um we get we can get these testers and we can sniff them out and tell you guys what we think um, and we can share these with our friends and family um, today so we're gonna go ahead and start with the brand new releases for the 2020 spring summer catalog um, this is what it looks like if um, I will leave my contact information down below if you'd like to get a hold of me um, so um, we're gonna go ahead and jump right in so the first one is Berry Bright. I am so excited for this one. Um, stay tuned because I will be doing an upcoming haul with you guys. Um, super excited to get it in. So Berry Bright smells like a r blue raspberry slushy. An icy snow cone. Um, Jolly Rancher even. Um, it's that like artificial candied like blue raspberry. Um, that's all I get from that. It smells really good. I think it's going to be a great performer. Um, Scentsy says, blue raspberry and fresh clementine light the way to sweet sugar plum. All you get is that blue raspberry. I think it smells fantastic. I have not warmed this one yet. I'm excited to warm it and get a bar of it. Um... Next up is that ch is chili mango. Um, chili mango, I feel like is like gonna be like a unique. You definitely get that mango, but it's not so much spicy as I was thinking it was going to be. Um, I think it smells amazing. Oh yes. Um, you definitely get a little bit of that like chilliness to it. Um, it's. But it pairs really well. I think I, I really in, will enjoy that. Um, Sensi says, just sliced mango and juicy peach got a little rogue with a sassy hint of chili. Now, peach, I really don't get any peach. I get more mango. Um, next is cocoa lime. I have warmed this one. I love this one. Um, cocoa lime. All you get is that lime with a little bit of lemon oh it's so good and even when it's warming it's fantastic i absolutely love this scent um since he says coconut milk and a creamy vanilla get and get get energized with a citrusy splash of fresh lime um i don't get really much of that coconut milk um But you definitely get that lime in there. It smells amazing and it smells even better warming. That's one of my favorites. Um, here comes the sunflowers is another new one. Hopefully you guys can see this okay. Um, so you get like a sweetness from it from honey. You get like a touch of maybe vanilla. And... That's all I'm getting from here is like a honey, vanilla honey scent. Um. Okay, so maybe that's it. Okay, so Sensi says, sun-kissed petals and fruity musk celebrate all things spring with a sweet pop of strawberry. Um. Okay, so maybe you do get a little bit of strawberry. Um, and maybe it's the... What I thought was um, vanilla was the musk. It smells amazing. I can't wait to get a bar of this and start warming it. Um, hibiscus pineapple is next. Another brand new one. Pretty pink wax. And you definitely get like a slight floral, fruity floral. And it smells fantastic. Oh, yes. Um... And you definitely get a little bit of like a musky, not so bad. 
it's not, um, oh, I do love this a lot. Um, so since he says, Mandarin, coconut, and a touch of warm sandalwood tell an enchanting tropical tale. The sandalwood is what's giving it that musky. And I think it smells fantastic. All of these new releases, I feel like, were done perfectly. Um, Iridescent Pearl. It's a pretty, like, tealish blue wax. And this is so relaxing. I feel like this is a... You're sitting out on a beach. It's relaxing. Maybe a little aquatic. Smells fantastic. Um, that's why it's so aquatic. Um, lustrous layers of ripe, juicy mango and apple blossom wind down with tranquil water lotus. Um, as far as mango and apple blossom, I really don't get any mango. Um, you do get that apple blossom and you definitely get that water lotus. That's for sure. Sorry if you guys see me looking down a lot. My notes are all right here in this book. Um, a holo coconut. It's another pretty little blue wax. <sighs> I'm kind of picky about this one. Um, I don't think I, I'm going to like it when it's warm because I don't like it on cold sniff. And what I mean by cold sniff is like, before it's even warmed. So this is cold, like considered a cold sniff. And then you'll see consultants rub their fingers on it to kind of warm it up a little bit. I think this smells like a crayon. And I hate to say that because, but um, please don't go by my judgments. Get this for yourself, try it out. Um, I'm gonna try it out even though that I think it smells like a crayon. Um, since he says paradise is only a whiff away with floral Hawaiian, Hawaiian lei and violet over fresh fruity pineapple. I don't get much pineapple and maybe that's why I don't like it is because, um, because of the violet. I think the violet's throwing it off for me and making it smell like a crayon. Um, we have mineral oasis. And ah, smells so good. Mm, I could sit here and smell this all day long with you all. Um, but I don't think anybody's got time for that. Don't mind my hair. I don't know what's kind of going on with it. It's kind of just doing its own thing today. But Maholo or Mineral Oasis. Oh, it's an aquatic, fresh, um, Another relaxing scent. Oh, I love this. Um, since he says dewy seagrass and blooming osmanthus drift across dreamy turquoise waters. Oh, it smells so amazing. It's like you walk into a spa and this is what you smell. It smells fantastic. Um, peach nectar. I have worn this one too. And this one's a little on the lighter side. Um, about one day is all I get from this when it's warming in my warmers. Oh, it smells so good though. I'm such a peachy girl. Um, it's got a little bit of a, mm, I don't know how to word it. Um, it's a musk, uh, well, because I read the scent notes, but, um, you definitely get some musky in there. But it's not overwhelming musky. Um, since he says delicate peach skin and blue freesia settle into a bed of billowy musk clouds. And I absolutely love this scent. Um, when it goes away for the fall and winter time, this is probably going to hit my Scentsy Club. And if you don't know what Scentsy Club is, it's a subscription um, service that Scentsy offers. And... When scents get retired, like in June, we're going to be doing a bring back my bar. 
and that's only good for the whole month of June so that's the only time you can buy those bars um you can add this or add any of the bring back my bars into a Scentsy Club and they will continually to hand pour your wax for you until you decide to take it out of your Scentsy Club um, and then last but not least is Rainbow Sherbert, and I absolutely love, love, love Rainbow Sherbert. Rainbow Sherbert is an authentic Rainbow Sherbert. You get that. It smells just like the Sherbert. Um, and this can last up to like three days. Um, Sensi says it's a classic. Orange zest, sugared strawberry, and key lime zing, just like the real thing. And that's so true. I love it. It smells amazing. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Um, tomorrow we'll be doing some a different category. But those were just the all new releases. So, I'm going to go ahead and read off the names again for you. Um, there was Berry Bright, Chili Mango, Cocoa Lime, Here Comes the Sunflower, um, hibiscus pineapple, iridescent pearl, maholo coconut, mineral oasis, peach nectar, and rainbow sherbet. So I hope you all enjoyed. Again, I'm going to leave my contact information down below in the um, description and go ahead and hit the like button and leave some positivity. Bye. Thank you for watching.